Hey guys, I'm Dan, one of the engineers at Mishimoto. Today I'm going to show you how to install our silicone replacement hose kit for the 2006-2010 Chevy 2500HD equipped with 6.6 .6 liter Duramax. Let's check it out. Tools needed to install the Mishimoto silicone hose kit for the 2006-2010 Chevy 2500HD are Pick tool, 8mm wrench, 11mm socket, extension, quarter inch drive ratchet, 15mm socket, extension, 3 inch drive ratchet, pop clip pliers, a pair of pliers, coolant, and coolant funnel. Installation time is about 2 hours and is a 4 out of 5 on the difficulty level. The first thing we're going to do in order to get to the lower hose to drain the coolant is we're going to remove the splash shield that goes between the bumper and the inner fender pan on the passenger side of the truck. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and remove the lower hose from the radiator. When we're removing it, we're just going to slowly slide it back because there's no drain plug on this radiator. So the way we're going to drain it is by slowly separating the hose from the rad and letting coolant bleed. Next step, remove the upper cooling hose from the radiator. Next, remove the 15 millimeter bolts that hold the lower splash shield to the truck. Next, remove the lower hose from the radiator and the engine, as well as from the two ancillary ports. Before we install the lower hose onto this truck, we have to swap over a couple of things from the factory hose. First, we're going to swap over the two hose clips. Now, the Mishimoto lower hose comes with a CNC fitting designed to go onto the stock outlet. Now, if you're using a stock radiator, there's an indexed point on the side that the CNC fitting has to line up with. Okay, now it's time to install the lower hose. You're going to do this by feeding the lower hose up from underneath the truck. Okay, now it's time to install the upper radiator hose. All right guys, now it's time to fill the cooling system. Remember to use a 50-50 mix of water and coolant. All right guys, now that we have the cooling system all filled up, we're gonna go ahead and turn the truck on and turn the heat on high. That'll help us get any of the rest of the air bubbles out of the cooling system. All right guys, that wraps it up on the install. Take your truck out for a spin and enjoy your new Mishimoto products.